Welcome everybody, it's Lisa with Junk Journal Gems. I've got a new die cut that I've been playing with and I had an idea to use this in our grungy journal because I think it just kind of plays nicely with the theme of it and I'm looking forward to using it. You could do something similar by just cutting it and punching holes but the die that I used is called, let's see, the brand is Elizabeth Craft Designs. And the number is 1769. The name of it is Sidekick Essentials 5. And I'm hoping that you can see that okay. But here are, let me get rid of that. Here are the pieces that I'm going to play with today. There's different, um, it's like a, a number medallion um, circle. There are adorable little tabs that you can punch out and the different pieces that go with it. But I was thinking of somehow attaching this inside the journal. And let's just get started and play with it and see what we end up with. I first need to ink this and I meant to do this before. Of course I didn't. I have a different setup in my craft room. I um, did a little rearranging. I got one of those, um, I guess you call them parts drawer things at um, Menards. They had a really good price on them and I wanna say it's got like 40, 40 some drawers on it. And I put all of my buttons and metal parts in it and I, I'm really glad I got it. I think it's going to work out really nicely. Just going to grunge that up a little bit and we'll do this one quick. My dogs are in my craft room with me so hopefully they won't act up. My husband was watching wrestling with all the whistle blowing and the yelling and the shouting. <laughs> they don't, they don't like it. Well, one of them doesn't mind, but my little Maltese is, is not a wrestling fan. I don't know how she thinks she's going to survive in this household. If she's not going to be a wrestling fan. I just thought this die would be such an um, interesting and different piece to put in some of my journals. Actually, I can also use it in my own journaling and planning, so it serves a double purpose for me. I wonder, this one's going to be a flip up, so I'm going to do the back side as well. Actually, so will the other one, so I may as well do both sides while I'm at it and have the ink out. I hope you all woo, are having a good day. was unseasonably warm here today, which is fabulous. This paper pad is, oh my gosh, it's something that I've had forever. Um, it's just a two-sided vintage theme card stack. And I probably just got it from either Joann's or Hobby Lobby or something or Michael's, one of the three. Might have even gotten it when we had Tuesday morning in town before they closed during the pandemic. That was a sad loss. I liked Tuesday morning. You could get some things at really decent prices. Now, I <laughs> can't pick this one up.
fumble fingers. Got a bunch of necessary housework done today. I was a little lax about getting done, but I hadn't felt good for so long. Today I finally woke up and had a day where I felt halfway decent, so. Thought I might as well get some things done while I felt up to it. Okay, and I think I'll use one of these. I'm not sure which color I'll use. So I'm just gonna go ahead and ink both of them. some of these extra pieces out of the way. And then I also have my little container of reinforcements here. So let's take a look at how I'm going to assemble this. I'm going to go like that. This will go on that like so. Let's just set that and that aside. But on these, I'm thinking I'm going to put the reinforcements after I put this on here. So I rearranged my desk too, so. <laughs> ooh, fix my glue bottle, can you tell? Now it's, ooh, just oozing out of there. Rusted up some paper clips today and And a busy little gal. Let's get the pin back in here. Mm, I don't have a a grungy piece of paper. Usually I like to glue on a grungy piece. done. And this one will go behind that. This I'm going to glue. I think these are just so cute. Just something different. And I will try my very best to link this die. So if you're interested in it, you can go out and grab it. I just got it on good old Amazon. Oops. Let's see here. trying to do this so I don't mess up how I have this. There we go. So I'm just putting this on this piece. I'm going to then, maybe I didn't want to do that, fluff or duff. Wonk, wonk. Hmm. You know what I think I'll do? Where are my scraps? I'm looking for a piece that I can just use as a little hinge. Not that one. With all the scraps I have here, there's got to be something. A lot of these, though, are... Um, here we go. A lot of them in there are cardstock. I can hear my husband out in the living room chatting on the phone, so I hope you can't hear him too. 
I told him I was making a video, but I think his hearing isn't the best, so he doesn't always realize that other people can hear better than him. the pew over. If I can hear him, so sorry about that. I hope it doesn't distract from you hearing me. Not that I have anything brilliant to say, but we're here to craft. Pretty sure he's out there talking about wrestling. That's not what we're here to do today. There we go. Fun. So that way, pull it up. And then, let's see. I'm thinking I want that and then that. Do I want the dark one? And then maybe I want the blue one. Maybe I want it backwards. I think I do. It's a girl's privilege to change her mind. Oh my, and there go the dogs. Welcome to my world. Pearl, no. Pearl? Pearl, do you want a kennel up? Pearl, come. Well, she wanted to get in on the video action too. I'm thinking she's going to quiet down in a second here. So let's see. If I can do my. There we go. Pin in the glue bottle one handed for me is always challenging. So let's get this on here. Centered. That's pretty darn good. Okay, we'll get this on. And then this, super cute. Do I want it at an angle? I think I do. Why not? I have my arm for my camera attached to my desk and I'm seeing that it's wiggling a little bit and I hope it isn't too distracting for you. Oops, there we go. Okay, so I probably should have put the reinforcements on first. Let's see what colors I have in here. Mm. like that. I was kind of hoping for something like more of a print. I see two more of those. Oops. It's hard to grab these. I need two more. Keep your fingers crossed here. There's two more, I think. One. Oh. It's so close. Is this one? Nope. Oh, 
come on. Won't it be heartbreak if I'm short by one? That would be heartbreak. Ooh, 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 ooh. Your side. Awesome. Oh, and I hope you didn't <laughs> have my head in there. Okay, let's get these out of the way. And I'm gonna ink these up really quick. There's one. I should almost have my tweezers for this. Can you tell I did glue bottle surgery? I ended up soaking my tips overnight and one of them just was far too gone. And I was able to get this one working. So. Just so I have another one on hand, I did order another one. glued the wrong side. Fibber McGee. Here's one. <laughs> the gods are watching out for me and I haven't been inking these. Can you tell I'm doing a video and I'm trying to hurry for you? <laughs> oh, Lisa, 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 Lisa. There's this one. And this little guy. Then I want to also do, do I want to do reinforcements on both sides here? Would kind of make sense, wouldn't it? So I think I will. <laughs> Maybe on this side I'll just use those. And then on this other side, they don't have to be matchy-matchy. In fact, matchy-matchy is sometimes boring. Let's see. Need just one more of those. Okay, and we'll find some other ones. All right. A little more inking. What I'm doing to ink those is I'm just kind of sticking my fingernails in the holes and as I'm inking it, I'm pulling it with the dauber so I go, I kind of spin it at the same time. That's what I'm trying to say. So yeah, the wrestling that we were watching was the big tens and looking to see how they were doing in the finals and super cool. 
to see these guys that work so stinking hard. And the level of skill that they have is just so phenomenal. But we had one Wisconsin guy place first. So proud of him. That's cool. Oops. Let's glue on some more of these. <clears throat> This weekend just seemed to fly by. Too much to do and too little time. By the time you see this video, it will be into the work week already. There's that side. Yeah, this die I think is actually intended for people who use ring planners. But I thought it would be fun otherwise. Cookie. dog is licking her leg and I can't stand that sound. <laughs> that pee, you can't handle it. Yes, Missy, e, I'm talking to you. She sat there in, in the chair next to me and looked at me like I had nothing to complain about, which I really don't. entirely sure the piece that I haven't worked out is how we can attach this into the journal so I'm not sure yet if I'm going to put reinforcements on the back side of this let's first think through how to attach this I was thinking about putting this on the inside front cover So if we do that, I wanted to put actual rings on here. And so these pages would turn, but then maybe leave this back page as a pocket. I say, let's try it. Let's go for it. So. Here's what I was thinking about doing for rings. There are these jump rings, but I'm afraid they're gonna be too small. And I thought I saw, yes, I have bigger ones in here. 
on a necklace, and I'm not sure. An old necklace chain. And I'm not sure how that'll work because I'm pretty sure these are gonna be too itty bitty. I don't have the fingernails right now, so it's gonna be <laughs> it's gonna be so hard to hang on to these, and I hope you're gonna be able to see okay. I'm gonna move my chair out so I can see what your vision is like. It's not too bad. I hope you've been able to see everything else. All right, this is not the players thing I wanted, but let's give it a whirl. These are actually cutters. So let's see. It's just gonna be woohoo. Just gonna be too small. So why do I keep fiddling with it? Because I just wanna be absolutely sure. These little rings are called jump rings. And the reason why I'm trying to press on with these smaller ones is because I don't want rings that are too, too bulky in this journal, or it's just gonna take up more space. So let's see how that feels. So if that's down, no, it's too small. You won't be able to open it decent. That would be frustrating. So, back to plan A, or B, whatever it was. Okay. All right, this goes back in here before I lose it. Okay, let's try one of these because this other size is about the same size as that one. So we're gonna have to go to this size. I did not have anything that I could find that was smaller without going out and buying something. Where's the end of it? Is it like soldered? Oh, don't even tell me. might have to get some different jump rings because there is no how can that be I feel like I see an end right there let's see if that will work or <laughs> more than one way to skin a cat oh shouldn't say that Habit, I grew up with the same. Okay, let's try this one. Keep your fingers crossed. It's gonna work, it's gonna work. I know it. Yay, come on. There we go. Come on. Now let's 
let's see. Oh yeah, that's cool. Okay. <laughs> fun, fun. Okay, let's get the next one. We'll need six of these. So I might as well cut them all off right away. Two. Come on. Three. What's this? like umpteen billion different sizes of <laughs> jump rings on here and now I'm losing track of which ones I need. I need this one. Goodness me. Now we need one more. Okay. See, old jewelry comes in handy and I, I have no idea where I got this from. None whatsoever. Why is this one? There we go. There. Get these out of the way. Now, let's see what that will look like inside our grungy journal. So, actually, I think I don't want to glue it down for a pocket pocket. Hmm. But maybe we want it, look how cute that is. Maybe we want it as a tuck to go just here maybe. And then you open. I think that's exactly what I'm gonna do. just like that and I'm going to let that dry and then you 
to be able to write in it right here and right here. Oh, I really think that's adorable. Oh, so there we have our first piece in there. And then I think that the way I will approach this one is we'll just go through some of these pages I'm going to want to kind of grunge up a little bit more and um, maybe do a, put a, apply a little paint. I already started putting some things in place where I want to add some things. So um, it's going to all start coming together for us. So stay tuned for the next one. But I thank you for joining me today. And I hope you have a great week. Take care. Hit thumbs up. Click subscribe. And then you'll be notified for all the upcoming videos. Take care.